this is wonderful to be here today and recognize young men and women who do such outstanding things. My little tour through this facility today, we not only saw what young men and women can do, but we saw what adult men and women can do. I had the opportunity to see something that Nevada has specialized in. People don't realize that one of the most earthquake prone places in the world is the state of Nevada. And as a result of that, I became interested in what the University of Nevada at Reno was doing regarding research on earthquakes. And we've done some tremendously important and valuable work there. We now have um, 15 or 20 international students studying, doing graduate work there at the University of Nevada Reno. The reason is because we have these shake tables. People come from all over the world to study what goes on when buildings are shaken and how we can do a better job of constructing them. I had the opportunity to visit uh, over one of these tables. Eighth grade students who last year had a contest in building solar vehicles. They had some requirements they had to make. Unbelievable what they did with these cars out of just a uh, soda pop can, uh, some toothpicks, and anyway, they have these cars that move based on sun shining on them. I had the, the opportunity to see some robots here who play soccer and other things. So this is wonderful to be able to see what these young men and women can do, what the people that you saw shooting this t-shirts in the air, that, that, wasn't, that, that wasn't done just to, to be doing something. Uh, NBA came to um, this design reality show and said, we need an instrument that will shoot these t-shirts up in the upper reaches of these basketball stadiums. That's what this is all about, and it works.